Hello and good day to you. Today's video, I'll be documenting development process of my game titled Crafter's Dictionary. Crafter's Dictionary is a game and also an online edition book, an ebook. The game Crafter's Dictionary is a text based game which is derived from the bo my book titled Crafter's Dictionary which as a dictionary, it illuminates terminologies using the creative industry. I've already programmed some part of the game in uh, Unity, and I'll just uh, go through it. Here you can see, below here you can see the UI keys here. And uh, we have a, I've not finished arranging them properly, <laughs> so pardon me. Then uh, we have a quiz manager here where we have the questions. I just limited it so that it's not too long without it going to show the answers since I'm just um, doing the development log. So here I have uh, answers and you can see I just did a repeat here because I'm using array. That we have and the array is 53 and you have but because i'm using array it's going to be 52 because the first number using arrays it's always zero this game i plan it in such a way that you can play it using your desktop or you can use your mobile phone that is why you can see that this kind of vertical is uh <laughs> In the shape of a phone, sorry, shape of a phone. Oh. So I'm just going to click on play and we'll use the desktop version because I've not finished programming the mobile version. So here we have it. It asks this question Christ, ginger that has been coated with sugar crystals or sugar. The answer is uh, crystallized ginger. And with the enter key, you notice that we have level one being imputed there. So I'm just going to, um, okay, a digital or physical block of a quilt design. It's a quilt block. Okay, and you see we have number two. Perhaps I just, okay, I just noticed something. I'm going to make sure the questions don't go to the edge. I'm going to make sure there's a kind of border here so that the questions don't run to the end of it, of the screen. So note that. That's why it's good to uh, test your work so that you have a uh, good feedback. The act of applying, act of applying names, initials or inscription on any object or work surface is known as lettering. <laughs> Okay, you can see that that is working. All right, so I've already programmed the. I'm still pro sorry. I'm still programming the UI key, so I'm just going to type just some words, and you can see that they have been programmed. I've not pro I still have uh, to program the space key, the enter key, the submit. Okay, the answer is the uh, embossing powder. That's why submit and. Uh, we have another one, a metal or plastic cylindrical with removable. So I still have some keys to program. This is just the correct answer because there's a way I programmed one that said we pop the correct answer. So I'll just come to this and put it, turn it off here. That's this one. Say so answer area dot equals to correct answer to lower so if i once i mute that that's going to be that's on answering so you can see that my codes i muted some because i'm still testing them so i turn them to comments so with that i'll continue updating you on it just um what um oh <laughs> since i put them in okay are we still here i didn't do this on this one so on return function and
So I'm still programming. I'm still working on still finding some error, trying to rectify. So I've rectified. You can see that some it is clear now. So I'm still programming and working on it, and I'll keep you updated as we go on the. So I'll keep you updated as I progress with the game. So thank you for joining me for this video. On to next development log of Crafters Dictionary game. Happy gaming. Bye for now. Thank you.